Hi, my name's Paul Wood. Most people know me as Woody. I'm a football freestyler who travels around the country and across the world performing for corporate events, promotions, exhibitions, adverts on TV and film work. Welcome to the InterSoccer website. My nickname um, is one which stuck. Uh, my old man, my dad, um, he was always known as a Woody and I followed suit, so my nickname is uh, Woody. Um, I grew up in London, North London, uh, in a place called Southgate, and I recently um, moved to a place in Hertfordshire called Welling Garden City. My soccer hero, my all-time soccer hero has got to be the big man himself. Uh, for me, the best player who's ever lived, Mr. Diego Armando Maradona. My dream team has got to be the team which uh, my dad took me to my first game when I was really, really young. Um, supported them ever since. North London club, the best North London club. In fact, the best club in the world. It's got to be Arsenal Football Club. Greatest moment has got to be Arsenal's double um, when we went through the whole uh, season unbeaten. Um, that was a great season. I just obviously being a part of being able to see that. I don't think that will ever happen again in the history of football. One week I might do an hour each day, five days a week, um, and then I might mix it up because of different events you do. Um, obviously you have to perform in different ways. If you're doing a stage show throughout the day, you're going to be working a lot harder than if you're doing a five minute performance, obviously on a football pitch at half time. So then I might vary it and do like two to three hours a day and do it to, uh, two to three times a week. And you just mix it up like that, so obviously so your, your body's ready and it can obviously deal with different situations you're faced by when you're performing, you know? The first thing I do when I'm on the training ground, I'd have to say, it's very, very important to warm up. I think um, you've got to make sure that you look after your body, uh, make sure you stretch it out and stuff, because um, believe it or not, freestyling is very strenuous. I mean, playing football, obviously, as you know, um, it's very important to warm up doing that, but um, you don't realise what you put your body through uh, when you're actually performing and you're freestyling, different muscles you're using, the way you're tensing them and so on. It does take time on your body, so it's important to do a good warm up. So I make sure I do that before I start my training. My favourite trick, I'm going to have to say my favourite trick is my signature move, my trademark, which I came up with, um, which is now called the Woody. You work from a basic of, um, off of a basis of doing kick-ups um, and you've got to learn to balance the ball on your foot and catch the ball on your foot. But <clears throat> if I'm going to say a major trick, which was my first major trick, um, from balancing on my foot, I'd say flicking up and catching the ball on the back of my neck. Um, I saw people do that and I was very wowed by it. I remember seeing a guy over the park do it and I was like, I want to be able to do that. Chips or salad? I'm gonna have to say salad. I'm trying to be quite healthy as much as I possibly can. I like a bit of salad. Something what I've always gone by myself. I mean, whatever you're doing, um, obviously you want to follow your dreams. You want to work as hard as you possibly can um, and practice. So those three things um, are very, very like, important. But honestly, just practice, practice, and more practice. My favourite food, I'm going to have to say, it's a typical one for footballers, but pasta. I love a bit of pasta, uh, whether you put a tomato sauce on top of it, bolognese, uh, carbonara, but I love pasta. I think if something was going to top the list for me, it's got to be a true story, something that's been there before, because they're just so much more real. Things like uh, Catch Me If You Can, just I think that's a great story with Leonardo, Leonardo DiCaprio. Um, American Gangster, just real stories, true stories I think are great, so anything which is a, a true story really. Top of my pops has got to be Jay-Z for me. Um, I like obviously R&B, rap, um, I like Funky House, I like a lot of music, but my all-time favourite artist who I do love um, has got to be Jay-Z. It'll be my Range Rover. Nah, <laughs> I think it's got to be. Um, I'm only saying that because I'm hoping if someone's looking down on me, she doesn't break down on me at any time. But um, I'd say a Ferrari, a black Ferrari. 
when I'm away from my job and I've done my training and um, I've finished working, I do like to chill out, go to the cinema, um, go out with my friends to clubs and stuff, as um, long as I'm taking it easy, being sensible and what have you. Um, watch football matches, um, whether it be on the TV or actually go into them. I don't watch much TV either. I think, yeah, kids should be out and about playing out in the garden, catching a ball, throwing a ball, kicking a ball, whatever it may be. Um, I think there's too much kids being stuck in playing computer games and stuff like that. So I very much to be active, like, like to be active and doing things, whether it be playing tennis as well or going swimming, going to the gym. I think it's important to keep yourself active. I mean, watching the box, you know.